after Javante Davis's uh, recent performance against um, Uriokos Gam- Gamboa to win the WBA regular title, I've just been thinking about uh, where this actually leaves uh, Tiafimo Lopez. Obviously, Tiafimo Lopez is signed with uh, Top Rank, and Top Rank obviously promotes and uh, manages uh, Vasil Lomachenko. So it seems like the most logical step is that they're going to try to make a unification fight between uh, Tiafimo Lopez versus uh, Vasil Lomachenko. Now, in my opinion, I don't think Tiafimo Lopez is actually ready for Vasil Lomachenko. I feel like Vasil Lomachenko is just too advanced. Obviously, Tiafimo Lopez is pretty young. He's only 22 years old, and he's managed to win the IBF title by beating uh, Richard Comey at the age of uh, 22 um, in only his 15th fight. And obviously, um, I know it says here that Lomachenko has only had less than 20 fights himself, and he's already unified. Not unified, but he's already won world titles in three weight classes. But I feel like uh, Lomachenko is just from just from a boxing IQ point of view is probably a bit too advanced for Tiafimo Lopez. I feel like Tiafimo Lopez will struggle with Vasil Lomachenko at this point in time. So I feel like uh, Tiafimo Lopez should actually get a fight with uh, Devin Haney. I think that a fight against Devin Haney would be a very good fight. He should be able to get win the WBC uh, regular title. Obviously, uh, Vasil Lomachenko has the actual franchise championship. This uh, WBC thing is just, just getting ridiculous now. But if he can beat Devin Haney, I think that's the fight that um, Tiafima Lopez can actually win. Uh, Devin Haney is not actually beating anyone legitimate. Yeah, and if he does fight Tiafima Lopez, if Devin Haney was to win that fight, whoever wins the fight between Tiafima Lopez and Devin Haney will be, uh, in my opinion, the second best uh, lightweight in the world with the first best lightweight in the world being Vasil Lomachenko. He could also get a win fight against uh, Javante Davis, which will be a very good fight. But in my opinion, um, if he was to fight Javante Davis, uh, my money will actually be on Tiafimo Lopez. I just feel like uh, Javante Davis doesn't seem that serious about the sport at this moment in time. Um, obviously, his uh, lackluster performance against Javon, uh, against Uriokos Gamboa didn't help. And on top of that, um, in his fight against Gamboa, he came in a bit too heavy as well. So I feel like Tiafima Lopez uh, could potentially beat Javante Davis um, if he knows how to outbox him and fight from the outside. So um, And obviously there's another fight against uh, Tevin Farmer, which could be an interesting fight. And that fight could be relatively easy to make. Obviously Tevin Farmer's with the D- zone and the zone has worked with top rank uh, quite a few times. So that could be a fight that could actually be made. But I think at this point in time, I think he should uh, try to avoid a fight with... Um, Vasil Lomachenko. I feel like Vasil Lomachenko is just a bit too advanced for Tiafima Lopez at this moment in time. So that's my thoughts below. Uh, t- tell me what you think below and obviously just like and subscribe to this channel. I've got a lot more content coming your way. Peace out.